Yo. 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 What's going on? See a piece in the TV back there? Uh, I've delayed this video for long enough. Uh, we've been moving house. We're in a new home, little flat. You can see back there, there's a shadowless Charmander, my pride and joy. Old Trafford, well, two thirds of it. The Xbox One's upside down. It's crazy in here. We don't have a proper setup right now, or at least, well, we didn't have a proper setup in the last place either, but this place is a, a lot less proper. Let me put my good luck charm in for today's video. The Jade Butter. Because today, we have this Fusion Strike Elite Trainer Box. I've been avoiding any spoilers for this set, so I literally have no idea about any of the well, presumably Mew and Mewtwo are in it, because, you know, that's what they do. But I don't know about any Ultra Rares or Rainbows or anything along those lines. Looks like we've got... Oh, is that a Gengar VMAX? Oof. Just from the artwork on the on the cardboard thingamajig that wraps the trainer box up. I'm seeing a Gengar VMAX. I am a big Gengar boy. Big Gengar fan boy. Let me see if I can get this peeled away. And I can see if I can kind of show you this dope, dope artwork. So you got Mew. Gengar, Boltund, and a Genesect down there at the bottom. Very nice. Don't think that's going to go up on the wall, but we'll see. Here we've got the inside of the carton, nice and sparkly. Beautiful. We've got our packs. It's eight in this one. Ten in the, whatever it was called, shiny fates, but eight in this one, which is fine. I'm okay with that. The usual poison and burn counters. Oh, nice. So the themed dice. See that clear dice? It's really nice. Yeah, yeah, they're awesome. Damage counters as well. Got the regular energies and shit. Pluck them round to the side. And we have our dividers, which also are Mew oriented in this one. You gonna focus there, telephone. There we go. Who oh, doesn't like that side, does he? We'll give up on this. Trading card game rules. Nah. Pro card. Nah. And then we have the sleeves, which are very nice as well. I'm gonna open these up because hopefully today we're gonna pull some stuff worth sleeving. So we're starting with a Genesect pack. A Genesect pack. A Genesect pack. Oh, the code cards are a whole new thing. Check it out. New code cards. You love to see it. It's a bit of an effort, this, but let's see what we can do, mate. Eh? You got a Vault Orb? Pack number one. Got a Pansage. Got a Kufant. Hey, that's nice. Gligar. Slugma. And a nice reverse ball toy. Ooh. Dojo V. See, some more comments and stuff, you know, the, you know the work. I like it when Kanto Pokemon get new formed cards. Strong start. We'll sleeve them up. Thank you, Jade Butter in the background. The strong stop. We'll pop him just there. Now we got a Mew. A Mew pack. Nice artwork on this one. Same code card again. I like how they're going back to one style of code card because, geez Louise, it was so heavy getting them green code cards, you know. Right, so we got a Durant in this one to start. A Pansier. A Minum with a little plusel in the background. A Baltoy. Whoa, Galarian Corsola. He looks a bit uh, heavy. Cook. Nice. Hey, and a Steelix Hollow. That's cool. That's a nice hollow. I like that. 
We'll keep him back there. A Heliolisk, Dunce Boss, and a Cramomatic. You love to see it. So we got, uh, let's save the Gengar pack artwork for last. There's two Gengar pack artworks, right? So we'll do Bond Bolton next. Same code card again. Let's see what we got in this one here. So are we starting with the Quillfish? Oh, that's a really nice full pix. Some giant chancy. Jeez Louise. Gentle slap from someone his size. Kill you. Galarian Zigzagoon. Oh man. That is some artwork. You love to see a monkey like that. That's awesome. A sizzly peed. Ooh, nice. Lucario V. Hey, this reminds me so much of a Furious Fist Lucario. Was it EX back then? Or G. I don't even remember, I think it was EX back then, but it literally had one move or a sphere, just like that. Nice, I really, I'm a big fan of that card. Elsa, Elisa Spark, he needs something stuck to it. Apologies for uh, the second half of the Poke Millers. She's not with us today, she's having a scram. With all this uh, moving in, just haven't really found the time to open any booster packs, but today, I got time, so I thought, let me crack these open while she's out having food. Whoa, now. This one's white. So I was just giving them credit for having not put this, or putting all the same color code cards in. This one's white and the others are black. We'll see. Maybe this means something, I've got something really special. Who knows? Sizzlipede. Although, the last three have been black, and I've had a hollow or V in all of the packs. Hmm. Right, well, we'll see. Stuffle, Sandy Gast, Puzzle and Minor, and having beef again. A different artwork, Vulpix. Nice, that's cool. Smeargle, looking funky. All right, so, I'm to presume then if you get a white code card, it's gonna be a non hollow. So let me, for my own sake, and for the viewer's sake, not look at the color of the code card. Pop that down there, and then we'll come and get this rubbish out the way. And then we'll come around. Here we go. So I haven't looked at the code card, I haven't spoiled the surprise for anyone. Sheldon, the most miserable Voltorb, maybe ever. He's seen some things, that dude, you can tell. A Pansage, a Kufon, a Sweet Gligar, Lapras, nice, and a Blissey. So let me check. Ah, yeah, see, <laughs> that one was white as well. Skate Park, let's go. Cool. Yeah, all right, that's really lame. So, for future reference, my guys, see a white code card, you can be disappointed because you ain't gonna get none. So I might just not look again at the colour of this one. I would like something a little bit textured, you know? Something a little bit special. Let's see what we can get in this pack. So we have a Tynamo, a Galarian Meowth, a Gossifleur, a Panpole, a nice Eevee. Power tablet. Watch out for them. Oh no! <laughs> Golden Flaffy, you joking? What? Of all the Golden Boys, you choose to pick Flaffy as a Golden Boy. Oh my goodness gracious. That is a Golden Boy. Gotta sleeve him up straight away. That's as golden as I've ever seen any card ever. Wow, that's awesome. I wasn't, I mean, I saw a bit of gold edge as I was pulling it up and I was like, oh, Flaffy of all things. The golden Flaff. Do you know what? I'm happy with that. That's a very obscure card. Magic loves. So we've got two packs left. We'll go Mew and we'll go Gengar last. 
how flat he is, just blowing my head clean. I was not expecting that at all. Right. So we got a nice clauncher. Got a growlith. A stuffle. A siglith. Gangster toxel. Reverse mining. Let me just check. Is that white? Yeah. I can 100% confirm if you see a white code card, you're very disappointed. Right, I'm going to do my best not to. Oh, I peeked. <laughs> I peeked so you guys can peek as well. Sad times for the boys. I know it's going to be a non rare, but I'm going to do the pack trick for the last pack. <laughs> Darkness energy. Maybe we'll get lucky. Puku Muku. Pitch a Puku Muku. That is very strange. Whatever. Bit of draw power, you never know. Schoolgirl. Chili and Cillin and Cress. See, I feel like you probably need a comma. But you know. Uh, I didn't do English language. I bailed out of that. Got a nice mudkip. Sandy gas in the background. Ooh. For my Caterpie lovers out there. Nice. Big fan. And the more Pico. Seen too many of him these days. Eevee. The sad Voltorb. And the very luscious Arcanine. Fair play. Yeah, I tell you what though. Them white code cards. I'm not down with that boys. I'm not down with that at all. So we got one, two. Well, obviously, we got four black code cards and four white code cards because we got four hollows and four non hollow rares. How lame is that? We need to boycott this different colored code card maneuver. I saw the white one and I thought maybe they'll be even better than the black ones, but obviously, that is not how it works. Quick little recap, eh? We put that Steelix in a sleeve. So, the Lucky Butter, what do we think? I think, do you know what? He might come back. The three Thanoses were the one, I just didn't know where they were because of the move. A few regular Vs here. We got that nice Dojo, which is good to see. Rampage Drill. Love to see it. Got a nice Lucario as well. That's a really nice card. I'm a big fan of that. We got the nice hollow Steelix. And then obviously the highlight. I'm, I'm just getting a bit lost in this now. The really big highlight for me, anyway, was the golden Flaffy. I feel like. He should be shiny because of the sparkles coming off him, but he's not shiny. I have got a shiny Ampharos on Pokemon Go and I don't remember what color he was. But do you know what? I'm happy. I'll probably get a few more of these packs. I'm, I'm, I'm very much after that Gengar now. This big boy here. I'm after him. He looks like an amusement park ride. And that's what I like. So do subscribe if you haven't already. Do stick around. This is an addiction that will not suffice. I will need more of these packs in the very, very near future. Payday is just around the corner. And therefore, Pokemon will be getting a lot more of my cash money. Until then, I hope you have a nice, milled time. From the Pokemiller himself. And the female Pokemiller, who's not far away. She will also be wishing you it from her table where she's getting all the Chinese food, but you know, I'm not bitter or, or jealous. Stick around for more. Like, subscribe, do the works, whatever it is. Peace out. It's your boy.